Going into day three on this, um, not, well, our third attempt at doing this, um, we head out to, we head out to Wob. And Wob can be known for, well, it used to be known for some really big pike in it. And they're still there. Uh, you definitely have to put a lot more work into finding them but they're definitely there. And uh, not to mention uh, some of the big white fish that are in it. But we wanted to, uh, we got out <clears throat> and the second day, obviously it was a little slow. We hooked a slightly big, bigger fish, but I don't know, it, it, I don't know, maybe it was seven, eight pound pike, something like that. It, uh, he had a medium heavy that kind of doubled over and it, it might have been a bigger fish, might not have. They fight pretty good in that lake too. But we wanted, uh, I was, we were mixing it up. I had uh, a short amount of time to get out and fish and um, I was able to kind of drive out on, on Wob at this point, so we, uh, me and my buddy Aaron, we uh, got together for a couple hours and we head out and uh, for a short time we had a, a, a pretty good spot. There's this spot I know of that uh, has like these like 10 to like 12 foot tall weeds and at this point um, I had put like a correlation together of like I like this is where I was start like seeing a lot of these bigger pike um, deep weeds and uh, places for them to hide but also they're not just hiding they're they're uh, well it's they're they're great points for ambush points for fish like where then there's like a channel of like not so many weeds you know, you're gonna have fish hiding in the weeds, which is bait for them, but at the same time, it's a good place for a pike to ambush a prey. So these can be very deadly spots and you can catch some rather large pike in these. They're like tall cabbage kind of thing. I'm not specific on the name. I haven't really educated myself on the name of them. Or if I do, every time I do, I, I can never remember. But this is the kind of type of weed it is. And these spots can be giant magnets. They just, it's the prime spot for these fish. And this was the day, well not just the day, but it was the day I kind of started putting it together because that's why we were there. And sure enough, um, Aaron hooks into a pretty big one. And he also catches a very, very nice uh, whitefish. What is up, everyone? Oh, shoot. Hold on, Mike. Let me clean you off. All right, <laughs> welcome back everyone. So uh, we are here in a spot that uh, I know where there's like, it's like about 12, 15 feet of water and it's uh, some really tall grass. And we, uh, we're trying here, I'm gonna try for some walleye, pike, whatever, whatever bites honestly, but uh, I got a tip up set up already and I only have like probably two hours, three hours tops to actually fish right now. Um, everyone at the house was kind of grumpy today, so um, I only got a little bit to do this and then go home and edit some more videos for some other stuff. 
But anyway, um, I'm not going to waste too much time talking. I'm going to go and see if we can make this happen. I got uh, Aaron with me today, and we are, he's fishing shallower than I am, about, about seven feet of water. He's already seen a walleye, and I'm fishing the deep weeds. He's also trying to target whitefish at this point. Um, anyway, uh, we will get to this and I might set up the hub and start jigging for a little bit. I might not, I probably won't even set up the hub today. Probably not even worth it for the amount of time I'm going to be and it's not that cold out. All right, ciao. Dude, is that a big whitefish? It's not a big whitefish. It's a huge whitefish. Holy fuck. <laughs> Dude, yes. All right, we need to get a quick pick and a measurement, if you don't mind, for yeah. the tournament. Yeah. Woo! Epic. Sideways or horizontal? Ah, uh, sideways is good. Nice. All right, <laughs> should be able to take it out. Did he shit himself? Yeah, he's shitting. He had 24 and a half. You got, you got a few, you're all set. Yeah, yeah that's good, man. Oh, that's a huge, that's thick. That's so thick. What were you using? Wireworm and a little, uh, just a little white, uh, yeah, like a crappy tube. Fuck kinda. yeah. That's awesome. I could keep them, but you know what? It's, it's kind of big. That's know? huge. I got, man. I got fish in the freezer, too. <laughs> so, we'll say bye. Dude. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> All winter long! <laughs> only, All winter long! It only took like four months. <laughs> yeah, that's amazing. Oh, he's still here. See you, buddy. Maybe we should, uh, could you take like a really good picture? Yeah, I could take a good picture, yeah. 100%, man. There we go, folks. On the board. <laughs> well, Aaron is. I'm not yet. I was literally just about to start jigging. So, let's, uh, let's hop to it, I guess. So the game plan is, I'm gonna fish here maybe for like another five minutes, I'll see if I can, if I bring anything in, I'm just jigging. Uh, if I don't bring anything in, I am going to switch spots. I'm gonna move maybe a little further to the right. Aaron caught a really nice white fish, which is awesome, but we're going to, I'm gonna move right or left or something like that and just, just keep trying until I start marking fish for at least a couple hours and then if I don't catch anything, well, it's uh, go home and we'll come back another day. Open, go into day six, I guess. I'm gonna be filming all of March trying to catch a, catch a fish and then there's only two lakes I'm fishing. Two lakes I'm fishing for this 20 pounder and I, even if I get so I just want to beat my personal best. That's that's it. That's what the mission is here. So we'll see how this goes. Well, oh my Oh goodness. my god. He's ripping. Feels feels pretty good. Does feels it? Okay. Might have some weight. Yeah, the hole? Might have burned a line into the ice. Oh, really? Ah, feels weird. What's going on? He's swimming towards me or something. <laughs> yeah, he was swimming towards me. I think this is going to be a good fish. Come on. Oh, this is going to be a good fish. Is it? Yeah. Should I get my scale? Oh my god. Oh my god, dude. Yeah. That might be like, that's 12. Well, oh, shit. I'm not going to start You're calling numbers yet, but it might be a 40 inch. Oh, oh yes! <laughs> Look at the size of that. Okay, I'm gonna That's go. high 30s. Barbless hooks are so nice. Nice hustle. Nice. You got the board too. Good man. There you go. Okay. Alright. 
and then let me power up the scale here. Yeah, I'm gonna enter this right. definitely for the tournament as well. Good. Is this your yearly tournament? Yeah, it's just like the inter-office tournament. Oh yeah. Yes, <laughs> that's a good one. Yeah, that's gonna be. It's high. at least 32 probably. High 30s, mid 30s. Oh yeah. 30, 35 and three quarters, 35 and a half. 35 and three quarters, nice. Um, here, I'll get. Uh, you wanna see how heavy it is? Oh yeah, sure. If you can, if not, it's okay. Is it queued up? Yep, she's queued up, she's ready to go. I'm gonna say 14. Point three, or I can't really see that. 12, 12, 3, 12, 3, 6, 12, 3, 4. Yeah. Whoa. Okay, you want to release it? Sure. Ready? You want to you see if we can get a nice, a sick release shot here? Yeah. The head in the hole? With your nice camera, your good skills. Yeah. Yeah, go ahead. I want to kick. There he goes. See you, girl. <laughs> Solid. Yes. <laughs> All right, that's good. Thingies are cold now. In action, anyway. More action than we've seen in a while. I know. Reagan gotta love March. Okay. All right, we're getting <clears throat> so you've seen the big pike, um, which was a really nice one. And uh, we have like if you have fished Wob, you would know that there are actually some bigger ones in there. And it's really cool. It's a lake you, at this point in time right now, you have to put the time in sometimes to like, kind of come across them or you need to put in you know, key times. I wouldn't say this was a key time of year, but it was getting close to that, 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 that spawning time of the March madness kind of thing. But, I don't think they were quite getting ready to spawn yet, so you're not quite seeing your numbers at this point in time on WAB. But um, we decided uh, I wanted to head back, so we had had a, you know, a weekend away from that other lake, and we figured we'd, um, we'd head back. So <laughs> I was sick as a dog. Um, I had just gotten off of a bad bug and uh, you'll see <laughs> but uh, I probably should have stayed home because after this day I got oh man I got so sick after I, I think I ended up missing like two days of work after this um, we went out for the day for most of the afternoon anyway and um, uh, this was like the last section of the lake that I could ice fish. Um, everything else wasn't really safe or actually there was some other areas I could have gone to but at this point in time this was the last section I could actually ice fish and it was also getting close to the end of uh, end of our ice fishing season um, or at least mine at this point. So this day was a complete run and gun day. Um, there are a bunch of fish that I did catch that I didn't actually put on there, but really there were no real size to really put into it. Um, but we did catch quite a few more than I think I did uh, than I do show. But I, uh, we did a lot of running and gunning. I got there early and I was hitting different spots, just different sections, inlets, like, or not inlets, sorry, um, like uh, inside bends, out, uh, like, you know, inside bends, um, outside bends, 
bays. Um, we had this one spot where we um, there was this nice little kind of, it looked like there was a little bit of a like island and then there was like a big bay and it was a little bit deeper and then there was a weedy side around the edges and it was like a big bowl and I think it was like 25, 30-ish feet and uh, Aaron was with me again and his friend hooks into this uh, decent pike it's I, at this point in time on this lake it had been one of the bigger ones we had actually seen um, <clears throat> which was really cool and once again you know drop off weedy edge around the sides um, which really started you know we're, we're, we're really starting to put things together on this lake of where we're going so that's why we're doing more running and gunning because we're looking for more key specific spots to try and see if we can locate a larger pike of course um, and that's kind of what's kind of nice you're starting to you've been learning a lake you're starting to learn key structures that some of these fish are hanging out on now as you're going to do it and you're looking for it maybe you don't have like as you come across these key structures now you can start to target them a little bit better which this works that like and this method works for like anywhere when you're on a river when you're when you're on a uh, lake like any body of water really once you start to notice where you're catching these fish well now you start to target these spots more often and that's what really starts to that's when you really start to see the progression of the size of your fish starting to go up and um, obviously when you go to a new lake you have to put this together but it helps you break start to break lakes down a little bit faster so i hope you enjoy one tip up which isn't bad it wasn't very big though so we will put it there and we'll keep trying I'm glad that I was, I was kind of worried that we weren't gonna see anything but we're definitely seeing something so sweet although that is not as healthy as the fish that I've caught on this lake I've seen so don't know if that's good or bad Maybe they're just spawn. No, they're they're spawning. They're, they're not spawning yet. They'll be spawning in April. Um, yeah, sweet. Oh my god, I got a fish! What the? No way! <laughs> he hit it on the way down. <laughs> oh well, that's too good. He wasn't very big though. It might have been the same fish. Very good chance it was possibly the same fish. <laughs> oh well that sucks and I lost them too I, I didn't realize I actually had some I should have just set the hook <laughs> that's too funny too too funny sorry if I lack uh, energy a little bit today I'm a little bit under the weather here 
I am attempting to uh, get over a cold. Actually, I'm pretty much over it. It's just my voice decided to go on me. And now all I got, like, now I'm just kind of on the final stages of it. And it's, I got a feeling this one's going to get hit pretty quick. Judging by that. Just off the bottom. We're gonna take this bad boy out. Wait and see if she gets hit. And we're gonna go drill some more holes over there. And we're gonna try and find some more structure. I'm on a big, big flat. It's really cool. It's like 14 feet here. It's three there. Over back there is one. Yeah, one and a half. That's six. So I'm in a big, I don't know, a hole of some sort never been able to actually graph this lake so I don't know how the structure specifically works. We'll see. Let's uh <laughs> let's go. <laughs> Woo! -hoo! guy, nothing crazy. All right, folks, we are, uh, we moved again. We're in a nice little cove here and we're gonna be Fishing in this cove, there's, uh, I got eight feet over here. I got 11 feet right here. So this is pretty cool. We're gonna, I'm gonna go in and pop some holes. I got two more tip-ups set up. And we're gonna, we're gonna see, see what happens here. I dropped down that one, as you guys probably already seen. Um, dropped down that one, is it, before it even hit the ground, I had something take it. For, didn't get the hook set quite, cause I was, it kinda caught me off guard. I wasn't expecting it. So yeah. We're gonna, I'm gonna go pop some more holes around here and see what happens. Wish me luck. Fits on your electric power head? Just a little guy. Whoops. Nice. A little bit of a fight. Oh, that's a good one. Is it? Yeah. Nice. Oh, hello. Oh, shit. That's not bad. I did not fight as much as that. Oh, 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 oh. That's Jeez. A really good shit. One. That's a healthy size. You want me to get the bump board? Uh, yeah. Ooh, let me go grab my new one. Or, oh, yeah, okay. you can grab yours. Okay. You didn't hit closer. actually that hard. Yeah. Dad, you want to grab it? <laughs> just, just buried. I know, I want, I want you to get one. Guesses? I say 26. Are you getting much price or no? No, it's still... Uh, How much do you think you weigh? <laughs> go for the whole, uh, yeah. the whole assessment here. Yeah. Let's go yeah, I want a picture. He's fatty. Yeah, I'll definitely get you a picture. Yeah, he's I got a big, he's, he's got a big belly. Look at that big belly. Yeah. <laughs> I say <laughs> seven, uh, seven, seven and a half. Five, two, nine. Nice, nice. Yeah. There you go,
ramp in. Here we go. Oh no. Oh. Oh. Oh, what the fuck? This is like six feet. Oh. Pretty nice. shallow. That's right. Yeah. I don't know if you got that rolling. Yeah, it's rolling. <laughs> 